And welcome back to Studio Gaming, episode 17, Operation Hot Hammer, to extract a VIP at the designated location. And as you can see, we're in the middle of the fight. Last time I took out uh, that codex. I do expect to be... Oh, there's another sectoid. And I think I remember that there was an Archon around somewhere. So, lots of fun. We still have some stuff to do. And um, let's see if we can actually do that. So right, move go. forward a little bit here. And then... Nah. Come on, focus. Do I have a combat protocol? I don't really want to use combat protocol if I don't have to. So Duncan would have an action left. If I move you up here... Oh, and I still have two actions back there. Oh, he's exposed! Good night. Critical. That is what you want to see. Okay. I think I'm going to overwatch the rest. I have ten more turns. And you will hunt her. Okay, is anyone concealed? No. Well, that's not good. <laughs> um, that will make things a little more difficult. Let's have a look. I want to see if I can get eyes on that sectoid. If you move up here. Ah. Well. So much for eyes on. At least we know where they are now. Unfortunately, Mauricio doesn't have an action left. But I think I have some more actions. So, and we have a Mimic Beacon. So... I could flank that guy. But that will leave me for a, for a flank from this person. Could run up, give him a plasma grenade. Can you go? That would be very dangerous. However, going here, this guy can run, hey. So, this will take the pressure off a little bit. Oh, it didn't get the, 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 the other sectoid in the back. Not cool. That is not good. Uh-huh. Lightning hands is down. Okay. I would really love to... Can you grapple up here? No, you can only grapple there. Why not here? <laughs> he needs to move. Regardless, so you move here. Moving to designated coordinates. Of 
course not. That would be too easy, right? At least that is full cover. Oh, you have a shot at the Archon. Coin flip, why don't you take it? Grazed, but it was a hit. It was a hit, so... Moving to position. He moves to full cover. I would like to cover at least these two, because they are in half cover. So he can still move. The big question is, where to? If I... Th if I go here... Throw a plasma grenade at this guy. I will do a lot of damage. Point one. And it will expose him. To a shot from Rachel, for example. Take him out. By the numbers. So I have, what, three actions left. You can only overwatch. Do I throw the Mimic? I won't need it for anything else, because I suppose that this is the last group. So I might as well use it and make my life easier. And less hurting. So you move up. And then I got you. I guess you move over here. Or maybe we next... Turn, I have a better angle depending on how the sectoid moves and the archon. Yep. Holo target. Yeah, he's holo targeted. It's still moving. Eight damage. So I hope that the sectoid also focuses on this guy now running here. Yeah, it shouldn't. And the Mimic survives even that. <laughs> nice target now. Both of them. I have an idea. Let's see if that works out. So let's see if I get a good angle from here. Otherwise I will use run and gun. Oh yeah, baby. Oh, oh, I misclicked. No, 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 no. Oh, it was enough, though. Sector is down, and the last points for the Archon will be a piece of cake, I think. So let's run up here. Well, let's see. Is there anyone who needs a promotion still? So Dennis has one. Darren doesn't have one. So maybe we can get Darren a kill here of the Archon and make sure that he gets promoted. 74% Stock damage only Who else? Maurizio Okay He already is high, highly ranked, but well He dropped some loot What we got? Valerian course and advanced scope. Advanced scope is very nice. And promotion. Alright. There is the way up. And we might encounter face. No, actually, we already had two faces. So I don't think there is any more of them. I would say let's. Uh, 
Let's move forward. Maybe not crazy. Because who knows? Heading out. Affirmative, covering now. If nothing gets uncovered this turn, then I think we're good. Yeah, no faceless anymore. Let's see if everyone can make it up here. Rachel? Ah, yeah, you can't. Okay. Then let's uh, take that turn. We have plenty of time. We've got plenty of time. Just in case the game has some shenanigans in store. So you never know, right? So I, I hunkered everyone here and these two stand in the open. That makes sense, right? Yeah, no, I'm wrong. It doesn't. Okay. Let's see that we get everyone out here now. Well, you can only make it to here. Oh, I think I have to... Go, go, go! There's too many people here. Yo me encargo. No need to ask twice. Yeah. I have to do it twice. Because this field is blocked. VIP secure and in position for evac. This is Firebrand. VIP is secure. All right. I think that's that was a good mission. Aside from that one grenade that we got, um, that was quite unfortunate. The rest was, I think, okay-ish. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Yeah, three soldiers wounded. They will be in the infirmary for a couple of days, but nothing serious. I don't think there was any. Uh, gravely wounded. No, I don't think so. Most under fire, Mimic Beacon. Yeah. They didn't really get a chance to fire back. And this is really what, what I love about uh, a good mission. When you can take out the, the pods one by one within a turn, so they don't even get to fire on you. There we are. Okay, um, I found out one thing in between episode 16 and 17, and that is uh, the experimental ammo. I appear to have some kind of bug in there, and I didn't really find an option to, to solve it. I don't use a crazy amount of mods compared to what I read about uh, mods on, on Reddit and, and in the Steam forums. So compared to that, I really have just, you know, like two dozen mods or something. It's really not a whole lot. I don't know where this comes from. And I don't want to risk completely screwing it up by uh, introducing uh, a new installation in the middle of the campaign. So what I'm going to do is I will try to finish the campaign without special ammo, which is hard. Because I originally wanted to have at least blue screen rounds against the robotic enemies and this is going to be very, very hard now. Um, let's let's see how that, how that works. Uh, I hope it's not the undoing of all the effort that we spend into this. Um, do I walk fire? No, I think, I, I think it's gonna be chain shot again. 
Chain Shot is just so good. It's just so good. Maurizio. Minus... 10% for critical hit. Interesting. I like this. No, it, I don't. Actually, it doesn't make sense for him. So it's Deadshot or Infighter. I think it's gonna be Infighter. Yeah. And then we have Dennis. And Dennis has been the uh, combat hacker. So that's where we continue. And Duncan also gets a promotion. That will be Medical Protocol. There you go. Uh, Codex Brain, two Illyrium cores, and an advanced Hello, scope. Commander. 134 intel. Very good. And we get another engineer. Badly needed for... Yeah, for what? Here. You start excavating this one. Thank you, though. Right. Um, right, there's one more promotion there. Uh, I'm going to do that at some point. I have the supply drop available. There's resistance contacts. There's a lot of stuff going on. Um, but first, let, let me grab those supplies that we were scanning before. I will have to let this go. Alien debris cleared. Uh, let me see. Maximum power consumption reached. Yeah, 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 you're fine. Here, um, go help out there, and let's clean that out soon. Let me get those supplies. Strategic resource located. Seventy-two. Oh, 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 oh. People, I think it is obvious what is Commander, up next. Continue to make progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Commander, we're almost out of time. The Avatar project is entering its final stages. The only way we're going to slow the Elders' progress is by destroying one of their facilities. We have to move fast or everything we've worked towards will be lost. Commander, now that we've established contact with the local resistance, we've got the details we need to move on the alien's facility. Yes, this Bradford. This is our chance to set back their work on the Avatar project. And that is what we are going to do in the next episode of XCOM 2 here at Story Gaming, episode 18, turn in, and um, yeah, we are going to do Operation Brooding Dawn to take out an alien facility. Thank you everyone for watching, uh, it was really fun doing this mission and the last steps of the uh, Hot Hammer. Um, I hope you enjoyed it, if you did, please subscribe to the channel, please hit the little like button. And I see you here at the next episode. Until then, I'm Stodier. Bye.